chosen to shine my light through the darkness. <sighs> that mind and body and spirit are all one. The goal is to be whole. If you choose this journey, then make it fun. I'll just go ahead and say it. I'm a free... Another unicorn hugger has struck back against Harley and his crew. This time it is fully raw Christina. Christina has long been criticized for being an ultra-happy unicorn hugger by the likes of Durian Ryder and myself, but Harley doesn't seem into it these days, but I am. Now, this is a rare thing for Christina because this may be the first time she's acknowledged the existence of the world outside of her YouTube channel. And Christina did this by creating a video response in which she claims that she is not fake by reciting a poem that she wrote. Now don't tell me you don't see the irony here. Being happy doesn't mean that I am a fake or a plastic. <laughs> I have seen it all. I have been dragged through the mud, I came out alive, and I still fall because I am not perfect. And I live on this place called Earth. And I wake up every morning, and I choose to remember my worth. I run in fields of blue bonnets and wildflowers, and I fall in love with me all over again. I've chosen to shine brighter than any obstacle placed before me, because I know that I am an incredible this human being. This is sad. My heart has light, and I will follow it home. Another note is that I'm not sure she gets what we mean by fake in Unicorn Hugger. Because in her title, she wrote, Am I a fake? Now that implies a whole different type of fakeness. What we mean by Unicorn Hugger is deluded, acting ultra happy. Yes, acting, as in fake. These people put on an act on the surface. But behind the scenes, they don't walk the talk. They're having people believe they're something that they are not. So you want them to almost think that you are the celebrity. You are God. You are the man. Oh. So then all of a sudden, they're like praising you. And they're like but I say there's something else going on. You do not have to live in a fake fantasy land to be happy and content. I don't. I am love, I am health, I am happy, I am me. This to me on so many levels is just me and it is personal. I find it <laughs> really to hard to believe. I making as many videos lately. This poem was her opening up and sharing of her feelings. Well, it got me thinking. Why did she need a poem to do that? She had to put it into a play in order to say something real, and it just ends up being fake again. <laughs> I'll just go ahead and say it. I'm a freaking resurgent unicorn. <laughs> said she's a unicorn person and there's many people also in this unicorn motif I don't know how long that'll last, because check this out. Near the top, this person calls Freely's video 
batshit crazy. And then underlined red, she says, I'm against hate in any form. Yes, I like unicorns. Freely, your extremism, negativity, judgmental attitude, and personal attacks on people have turned me... Again, the line in red. I am against hate in any form. Unicorns are fake. I <laughs> say they don't exist. I wake up every morning and I choose to remember my worth. Just because I am happy doesn't mean I don't experience dark moments, that I haven't been hurt or shamed or broken. Being happy doesn't mean that I am a fake or a plastic or that I'm inex- It just means that I have chosen to shine my light through the darkness. Why would we be criticizing somebody for being positive <laughs> that's not what it's about I have a video all about choosing happiness and another thing is I don't get it <laughs> just like I didn't get Cassie's video about the perfect body this seems like a similar marketing tactic blowing smoke up your fans butts and they think it means something. Well, most of the poem is good. Do you think there's just a communication breakdown here? Misunderstanding? One thing, one thing is for sure, this, this video is so unicorn. Unicorny. Just thought of that. that, that yeah, corny is right. Post your comments below, people.